Hello everyone, welcome to Learning Hardware Software. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to access your TFSense console using this application name, PuTTY. You can download PuTTY in the internet, it's just portable, so you can just Google it. Type PuTTY. This website. This website. Click here. Then this one. It's up to you if you want 32 bit or 64 bit. All right. Before we can access the PFSense console, we need to enable it first in its web configuration. So, we need to access the PFSense. You know, in our previous tutorial, I teach you how to initially set up your PFSense. So, the default username is admin, then the password default is PFSense. Alright, we need to go to system, then advance. Enable secure shell server and save. All right, we'll now access the booty. Where is it? We'll access the booty. Type the PFSense IP 192.168.1.1. Open. The username, admin, the password, PFSense. Alright, this is the PFSense console. So as you can see, it's the same as in the virtual box. This one. It's just the same. So this is how you do it. So Hope you like this video guys. If you like this video, kindly give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. 